Hey SunBitcoin fam, buckle up cuz we're blasting off with some cosmic news that's straight up stellar. This Valentine's Day, love isn't just in the air, it's heading to the moon, thanks to some bold US companies. Just weeks after a heart-stopping mission turned into a fiery spectacle in the Earth's atmosphere, NASA's got us on the edge of our seats again. This time, Houston's own Intuitive Machines is teaming up with SpaceX for a moonshot that's rewriting the space rulebook. NASA paid Intuitive Machines more than $100 million to ship its scientific hardware on the mission, part of a broader strategy to stimulate a lunar economy and delegate routine cargo missions to the private sector. They're swapping out the previous United Launch Alliance and Astrobotics gear for a SpaceX rocket that's got the Intuitive Machines Nova Sea Lander riding shotgun, all the way to the moon. The mission? To nail America's first gentle touchdown on the moon's surface since the Apollo glory days, making history with the first ever soft landing by private players in the space game. The countdown is set for a 12.57 a.m. launch from Florida's Kennedy Space Center, aiming to touch down on a lunar crater near the South Pole by February 22. And get this, NASA's dropping over $100 million for a front-row seat, sending up scientific gadgets to kickstart a lunar economy and pave the way for private sector-led space deliveries. The Nova Sea's cargo isn't just your average space gear, it's also packing some artsy vibes with sculptures from none other than Jeff Koons. Talk about style. Joining an elite club, only five nations have ever achieved a soft landing on the moon. The US led the way. With China. India. And recently Japan following suit, though Japan's attempt had a bit of a tumble. Despite a few bumps and crash landings by other non-government missions, the dream of a smooth lunar landing remains strong. Landing on the moon is no walk in the park, thanks to its tricky terrain and no air deal, making parachutes a no-go. SpaceX is targeting a 12.57 a.m. blast off from the Kennedy Space Center in Florida, with Intuitive Machines Nova Sea Lander expected to land on the moon on February 22, at an impact crater near the lunar south pole. It's all about the thrusters for a finesse-filled touchdown. So, SunBitcoin crew, are you ready to witness history in the making? Keep your eyes on the skies this February 14, because we're all in for a lunar love story that might just end with a perfect moon landing. Let's get hyped for this monumental leap towards the stars.